Welcome back to California Live. The aquarium at the end of the Manhattan Beach Pier has undergone a major makeover. And our Amber Fister is introducing us to some of its 600 residents. Hey everyone, today I'm so excited. I'm going to take you to Roundhouse Aquarium. This is the end of Manhattan Beach Pier. And guys, there is so much to see and so much to do. So let's go say hi to Michael. Come on. Hey, Michael, Amber, how are you? How are you? It's good to you see you. It. Well, thank you. This is quite the hidden gem here in Manhattan Beach. It really is. Yeah. And what's unique about this aquarium is it looks out to the largest aquarium in the world, the Pacific Ocean. It's incredible. This has to be the only aquarium that's just sitting on top of another aquarium. It's amazing. It's, it's a tiny aquarium yeah. with a big heart. It it's does a, it's have a, a big beautiful heart. aquarium that means a lot to not only the community, Community, but we get over 300,000 visitors a year from all over the country and abroad as well. So well, it's just a special place. It is very special and I know that there's a lot when you say heart, there's a lot of heart that you put into this too because the foundation, you guys did a huge beautiful renovation only just a few years ago. We did. So in honor of my son Harrison, we decided that we, this was an old dilapidated aquarium yeah. and we decided to redo not only only, you know, I think when I scared everybody when I came in and I said, I want to, um, I want to donate some money to the aquarium. They yeah. thought a new tank. Well, I thought, like, you know nope. what? No, I, I say <laughs> a whole new aquarium. Wow. And we went out, we found Cambridge 7, a world-renowned architectural firm yeah. that does aquariums all over the world. And they took this beautiful project on. Wow, well, they did an incredible job. So when you're walking around, it's funny, as you're walking up to the pier, you don't really notice how truly big it is inside. You walk in and you see this huge aquarium on this side, another aquarium here. Like, there's a lot to see. Absolutely. And, and I'm going to show you one fun aquarium at the end that uh, it's interactive. Ooh, yeah, okay. so we you like can participate. Over here we have four moray eels in this tank. And it's a good thing you can't put your hand in there because... Uh, <laughs> You might lose it. But this is what I look like in the morning. Yeah, Just these a little are crabby. these are right out from the, out from the Pacific mm -hmm. Ocean. Everything you see in this aquarium is beneath us. It's really it's all yeah. local animals. We have 600 animals and about 60 species here. Wow! So it's pretty spectacular. Yeah. And yeah. I've kind of been learning a few things. So for example, some of the things on the floor, you were saying these are actual sizes yes. of like an orca that you would see, and I think that's really cool. It's almost kind of you wouldn't know it unless you get the inside. That's right. And, and all these beautiful animals that are on the floor were donated by individuals. But yes, they are the actual size of the creature, the animal that lives out in the sea. Pretty spectacular. It is. Should I show you uh, the interactive part? Oh, yeah. I thought you yeah. never asked. Yeah. Come over here. So this is a touch tank okay. and it's one of our biggest attractions. The okay. kids love it. Um, they can't, you know, they, it says do not touch, but I have something in store for you. I'm going to reach down here. Okay. Now what is it that we're looking at here? Well, oh. this this is a sea cucumber. Okay. And they say that it might spit. Okay. They say that you, it brings you good luck if you kiss the sea cucumber. You know, I can use a little luck in my life, so I'm going to do well, it. Are we ready to do yep, this? Go ahead. Okay. Right? A little it's got, salty? It's a little salty aftertaste. I enjoy that. Well, that's going to bring you good luck. Okay, well, I'm all about it. So, everyone, make sure that you check out Roundhouse Aquarium because it's not only free, but it's open seven days a week. And it's free because of your amazing donors. It, it's We have a wonderful community that really built this phenomenal aquarium and it's a one of a kind like you said sits a thousand feet out from shore about 50 feet above the pacific ocean amazing all right well there you have it should i give it one more okay there you go uh, i can use all the kisses <laughs> <laughs> and luck i can get all right bye guys michael thank you so much thank you amber <laughs>